The Crestview Softball Squad is headed to the Division III Lexington District Finals to face Galleon after a 4-0 shutout win against third-seeded Colonel Crawford. And for head coach Aaron Goon, the key for a second-seeded Cougars was getting the lead on Eagles All-Ohio pitcher Sidney Studer. I think the most important thing for us was that first inning run. I mean, it gives Kennedy confidence on the mound. We had a couple of diving catches out there. Girls played hard. You know, that's the kind of defense we're capable of playing. You know, and I think that's the thing. Right now, you got to have your your best defense, your best offense in the playoffs, and we we had that tonight. Crestview scored all four of their runs in the first two innings, plating three in the second with starting pitcher Kennedy Hickey helping her own cause from the dish with this two RBI double. Not that she needed much help with an incredibly dominant performance from the circle. I had a pretty good view of your pitches today. It seemed like you were incredibly in command. Did, did you feel like you had your best stuff? Yeah, actually I do. Um, my go-to is just hitting spots and throwing my rise. And I didn't really mix in my change a lot today, but when I did, it worked well for me, I thought. And I also have a great catcher that spots up all my pitches. And that's the reason why I get the calls that I do, because she, she's always on the corner. She's always framing my like stuff up. And that's how I get do what I do on the mound it's because of her. She mixes pitches well. Her biggest thing is she can throw inside, outside, up and down. She can throw it anywhere and you know she kind of finds where the umpires like the strikes and she hits them. And uh, when she's hitting her spot, she's tough to beat. Hickey's 14 strikeouts now make it 14 of 17 starts this season where the fireballer has k double digit opponents and believes when she's pitching like she did against the Eagles, Crestview's tourney run may just be getting started. I feel like if you bring your best game from the circle, you guys are unbeatable? I do, I, and I think if we hit, all we got to do is score a couple runs, and I think that our defense and we can keep us in games with limiting the limited runs. So I think if we hit and yeah, play good defense, I think we're un pretty much unstoppable.